Hi, I'm Hank McCrane. Welcome to BMX Bike History. Harrow Bikes 1997. A BMX catalog.com and rerides BMX production. Before we get to the bikes, here's a quick brand history lesson. If you didn't already know, only a handful of bike companies have been around since the beginning of BMX. Harrow is one of them. They got started in the BMX business back in 1978, and we could go on and on about their illustrious history. It's tempting, since by 1997 they'd won nearly every title you can win. But we won't bore you with the details because that was then and this is now. Well, now, being 1997. So, sit back and relax, because this is BMX Bike History, Harrow Bikes 1997. Here it is. Everything there is to know about the 1997 Harrow Bikes BMX lineup. The largest range of bikes Harrow ever created in one year. This is more than just a bunch of pretty pictures. It's also an important tool that shows you an in-depth look at all 24 models, why they were different and who every bike was designed for. The 97 Harrow Elite Series. To this day, Harrow is a brand from which you expect innovation and quality. And back in 1997, the Elite Series of BMX racing bikes would have surpassed even your wildest expectations. No corners cut. No compromises made. Harrow simply made the best BMX bikes possible in terms of looks, features, and quality. These are the same bikes that were raced by the factory Harrow BMX team. For the full specs on every bike, go to bmxcatalog.com. The 1997 Harrow Elite monocoque frame was made right here in the USA. Its monocoque construction with depressed side walls eliminates torsion flex. It features a CNC machine, chainstay yoke, and custom Harrow Moto X style dropouts with integrated dropout saver. The removable brake cable hanger allows for the use of cantilever or V brakes. Cables are hidden with internal routing, and it weighs just 4.2 pounds. The 1997 Harrow Elite frame is made of Series 7000 custom drawn alloy tubing. The gusset at the head tube produces a combination of strength and lightweight. Square oval seat and chainstays resist torque induced flex. It also has an integrated dropout saver adjuster. This is the same frame as raced by factory Harrow BMX team. The 1997 Harrow Elite Pro XL is for the fanatic, the national points chaser, probably the last bike he'll buy before getting a factory ride. A Series 7005 aluminum V-bar frame with chromo thread less tapered 4, Shimano DX V brakes and Shimano DX lever, Shimano DX clip less pedal, Fusion Speed Racer 3 degree chromo balls, Fusion Chromo 180mm 3-piece cranks. Araya RB17 chrome-plated rims and Suzu sealed hubs with stainless steel spokes. Elite 24 is for the fanatic. The guy who enters pro and cruiser to win enough money to pay for a second bike. A Series 7005 aluminum V-bar frame with chromo thread less tapered 4. Shimano DX V brakes and Shimano DX lever. Fusion chromo 180mm piece cranks with Shimano DX clip less pedal. Fusion Race Light 6061, aluminum bars. Araya RB17 chrome-plated rims with Suzu sealed hubs with stainless steel spokes. The 1997 Harrow Elite Junior Tardy is for the young fanatic, National Points Chaser. This is probably the last bike he'll buy before getting a factory ride. A Series 7005 aluminum V-bar frame with chromo thread less tapered 4. Designed for and raced by factory rider White Tardy, it has a diacomp rear brake. Fusion Race Light 6061 aluminum bars. Fusion Forged Alloy 3-piece cranks. Yukai 20 by 1.125 chrome-plated rims. Suzu sealed hubs with stainless steel spokes. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 Series. The history of BMX wouldn't be the same without Harrow. Their deep knowledge of the sport is built into every bike they make. You won't find other bikes with the same frames and the same attention to detail. For the full specs on every bike, go to bmxcatalog.com. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 ELI is for the expert or pro racer who goes fast. 
knows everything about BMX, including what's cool. This ride has a Group 1. 7000 Series Aluminum Pro XL V-Bar BMX Frame with Threadless Chrome Mo Tapered Leg 4. Fusion 3-Piece Chrome Mo 180mm Cranks with Sealed Bottom Bracket. Diacomp VC 747V Brake. Fusion RC 3 Double Wall 32 Hole Rims with Stainless Spokes. Race Light 6061 Alloy 2-Piece BMX Race Balls. 3-Piece Spad Set and ACS 16 Tooth Free Wheel. Group 1 EL is for the expert level racer who likes big tubes and the responsiveness of an aluminum frame. A Group 1 7000 Series Aluminum Pro XL V-Bar BMX Frame and Threadless Chrome Mode Tapered Leg 4. Fusion Alloy Clamp on Stem. Fusion Alloy 2-Piece 44 Tooth Race Disc. Hex 1-Piece Chrome Mo 180mm Crank. Array of VP Wendy Rims. 3-Piece Spad Set and ACS 16 Tooth Free Wheel. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 RSI is for the expert tracer who wants the features of a custom bike without the high cost. A Group 1 100% Chromo V-Bar, double-butted BMX frame, and threadless Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion 3-piece Chromo 180mm cranks with sealed bottom bracket and Fusion Alloy 44 tooth race disc. Team Harrow Alloy Pedals. Fusion Alloy Micro with just seat post. Race Light 6061, Alloy 2-piece BMX Race Balls. 3-piece Spad Set and ACS 16 Tooth Free Wheel. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 SI is for the serious racer or rider who usually makes the mains at the local track. A Group 1 100% Chromo V-Bar double-butted BMX frame with threadless Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion Alloy Clamp on Stem. Hex 1-piece Chromo 180mm crank. Array of VP Wendy rims. Fusion Alloy 2-piece 44 tooth race disc. Fusion Alloy Micro with just C post. 3-piece Spad Set and ACS 16 tooth free wheel. Group 1 SI24 is for the improving rider who wants a second drive without a second mortgage. The Group 1 Chromo mainframe, Cruiser V-Bar BMX frame has threadless Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion clamp on stem. Fusion alloy 42 thrace disc. Hex 1-piece Chromo 180mm crank. Team Harrow alloy pedals. Fusion alloy micro with just seat post. 3-piece spad set and ACS 16 tooth free wheel. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 SI Jr. is for the young fanatic without a trust fund ready to win some mains at the local track. A Group 1 Chromo Junior V-Bar BMX frame and threadless Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion clamp on stem. Forged alloy 3-piece 165mm crank. Team Harrow alloy pedals. Fusion RC 3 double wall 32 hole rims. Diacomp side pull rear brake. Harrow racing unibody seat. 3-piece spad set and ACS 16 tooth free wheel. Group 1 CI is for the improving racer or wannabe who must look the part without blowing a ton of cash. The Group 1 Chromo Main 2 V-Bar BMX frame has a Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion 175mm crank. Fusion Alloy 44 tooth race disc. Team Harrow resin and alloy pedals. Fusion Alloy Micro with just seat post. 3-piece spad set and ACS 16 tooth free wheel. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 CI-24 is for the improving rider who wants a second drive without a second mortgage. A Group 1 Chromo Mainframe Cruiser V-Bar BMX Frame and Threadless Chromo Tapered Leg 4. Fusion Clamp on Stem. Fusion 175mm Crank with Fusion Alloy 42 Thrace Disc. Team Harrow Resin and Alloy Pedals. Fusion Alloy Micro with just seat post. 3-piece Spad Set and ACS 16 Tooth Free Wheel. The 1997 Harrow Group 1 Ti is for the aspiring racer, or average Joe who doesn't race but craves the look of a hardcore racing machine. This bike has a Group 1 Chromo Main Tube V-Bar BMX frame and Chromo tapered leg 4. Fusion 175mm crank with Fusion 44 tooth disc drive. Array of VP Windy Alloy rims. Alloy Canty lever brake. 3-piece spad set and ACS 16 tooth free wheel. 
Group 1ZI is for the kid who's ready for his first real bike, a step up from a department store bike. The Group 1 V-Bar BMX frame has a tapered leg fork and Fusion 165mm crank, Fusion 44 tooth disc drive, array of VP20 alloy rims with alloy hubs, alloy cantilever brake, three-piece bad set and ACS 16 tooth freewheel. The 1997 Harrow Freestyle Series. When it comes to freestyle, no one else even comes close. Harrow developed and sold the very first freestyle bike ever and they've never let up. In 97 they were a winning company, they always had been, and freestyle was at the heart of everything they did. Not because it was popular again, but because they invented it. The 1997 Harrow Blamo frame was designed for Dave Mirror. It features a 100% chrome omega tube frame with a 2 inch down tube and an oversized 1.125 inch steer fork. The massive dropouts only accept Harrow Mega hubs with 15mm axles. An all new Mega Frick with bosses for abs aerial braking system, rear 990U brake mounts, SSD orridge cable detangler, Diacomp headset, Fusion Chromo seat post and seat clamp rounded out. The 1997 Harrow Blamo is only for the fearless rider, who may have screws holding body parts together and gets a minimum 10 feet on vert. It features a 100% chromo frame and fork, Railmaster chromo axle extenders, Me Saver 2 chromo balls, ABS, aerial braking system, front brake and Diacompe D990U brake on the rear, SSD orridge cable detangler, Fusion 3-piece 180mm chromo crank set, Array RB907X alloy chrome plated 48 hole rims, Hero Mega Hubs with sealed bearings, and Hero Cashimax seat. Ultra Frame Set. This bike is designed for flatland use. It has a 2 inch down tube on a 100% chrome Omega tube frame, oversized 1.125 inch steerer, zero offset Mega Fork with bosses for the Fusion ABS, aerial braking system accepts ground round alloy axle extenders rear dropout accepts a free coaster hub rear 990u brake mounts ssd orridge cable detangler and diacomp headset fusion chromo seat post and seat clamp the 1997 harrow ultra is for the hardcore flatlander or high intensity street rider that has a large bank account you get a 100 percent chromo twin top tube frame 100% chrome omega fork with zero offset dropouts, Fusion EBS, aerial braking system, ground round alloy axle extenders, Diacompe D990U brake on the rear, SSD orridge cable detangler, array of Super 7X alloy chrome plated 48 hole rims and Harrow fat hubs with sealed bearings. Let's take a look at the 1997 Shredder Deluxe frame set. This bad boy is a mega tube chromo main tube frame with 100% chromo threadless mega fork. Designed for all around street, dirt or ramp use. It also has 990U brake bosses on the chainstays and a Diacomp headset. The 1997 Shredder Deluxe is for the versatile, aggressive and skilled street rider, approaching hardcore status. With a Mega Tube Chrome Main Tube Frame and 100% Chrome Omega 4, Mega Tube Chrome Axle Extenders, Array of 7 Chrome Plated Alloy 48 Hole Rims, Diacomp D990U Brakes, SSD Orridge Cable Detangler, Fusion One Piece Crank with Alloy 8 Ball Sprocket, Fusion DX Alloy Pedals, and Fusion Freestyle Seat with Oversized Drapes. The 1997 Harrow Shredder is for the average Joe. Not into racing, but won't settle for some lame average bike. It has a Mega Tube Chrome Main Tube Frame and Chromo Tapered Leg 4, SSD Orridge Cable Detangler, Array of VP Windy Alloy 48 Hole Rims, Harrow Multi Surface 2 Tires, Diacomp Bulldog Front and Fusion Alloy U Brake Rear. Fusion Freestyle Seat with Oversized Drails and Fusion Micro Adjust Layback Seat Post. The 1997 Harrow Shredder Mag is for the same average Joe as the Shredder, but hates bent wheels. Same Mega Tube Chrome Main Tube Frame and Chromo Tapered Leg 4, but with a CS5 Spoke Z Max, SSD Orridge Cable Detangler, 
Hero Multi-Surface 2 Tires Diacomp Bulldog Front and Fusion Alloy U-Brake Rear Fusion Freestyle Seat with Oversized Drails Fusion Micro Adjust Layback Seat Post Basher is for the hardcore area list on both vert and mini ramps. A future stuntman. The frame has a chromo seat 2 with a chromo mega 4. Integrated bash guard. Diacom Pemex 884 Bulldog Brakes. Assestio Ridge Cable Detangler. Array of VP20 Alloy 48 hole rims. Harrow Multi Surface 2 tires and Fusion Freestyle seat with oversized rails. The 97 Zippo is for street thrashers looking for an affordable yet solid bike with great features. It has a twin top tube frame, Diacom Pemex 884 Bulldog brakes, a CS16 tooth free wheel, a Sestio Ridge cable detangler, array of VP20 alloy 48 hole rims, Hero Multi Surface 2 tires, Fusion DX alloy pedals, and Fusion Freestyle seat with oversized rails. The 1997 Harrow Juvenile Series. Even little kids had the chance to appreciate the quality and looks of a Harrow. In 1997, there were four models. The YZF, the FCR, the Blaster, and for really little kids, the 16-inch Mini Blaster. The quality, rugged construction, and leading-edge graphics separated Harrow from the pack. The 1997 Harrow YZF is for young riders ready to step up to Harrow quality at a price that everyone can afford. A Harrow Compact Profile BMX style frame. Array of VP20 Alloy 36 hole rims. Diacom Pemex 122 Alloy Brake Levers. Fusion One Piece 165mm Crank and 3 piece Spad Set. The 1997 Harrow FCR is for young beginner riders smart enough not to buy a department store bike. A Harrow Compact Profile BMX style frame. Array of VP20 Alloy 36 hole rims. Fusion One Piece 165mm crank. Coaster brake and three piece pad set. Blaster is for the short, young, and hip to the benefits of steer and clear of department store bikes. A Harrow Low Profile frame. Array of VP20 Alloy 36 hole rims. Fusion One Piece 140mm crank. Coaster brake and three piece bad set. The 1997 Harrow Mini Blaster is for really small, young riders ready for their first real bike. Harrow Low Profile 16 inch compact frame, Fusion One Piece 4 inch crank, coaster brake and sturdy training wheels. And there we have it all 24 Harrow BMX models from 1997. Decals are available for many of these bikes at shop.rerides.com. For the full specs on every bike, go to bmxcatalog.com. We hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, give the channel a like and make sure you hit subscribe. I'm Hank McCrank. Join me next time for more BMX bike history.